Hello everyone, it's David here once and again and today we are going to do some fishing today and it's been a while since I've been fishing because of work and all this stuff but that's because, well, let's just say, you know, do the work and all this stuff. So today I am going to do that and I want to do this because I will be going away and all this stuff. I am going to Aruba and all this stuff. I'll give you in more details than that. But today we're going to be doing something a little bit different. Now I do have night crawlers, but also what I'm going to do is that I'm going to try this out. That's right. I'm going to try out some of these lures, these bluegill lures. I'm not really a fan of fishing with them because I've never really caught a fish, but I think that I, you know, I don't really have good luck with these, but we're going to give it a shot. I mean, why not, you know? So, yeah. So, we're going to head to the pond and we're going to go from there and see if they'll work. I probably am going to switch out once in a while just so, you know, try this one out. If that doesn't work, then I will go with the, the worms and all that stuff. So, okay, let's give this a shot. Let's head to the pond and we'll go from there. All right, so here we are, <clears throat> one of the ponds and all this stuff. So today we're going to be doing this, like I said. Not like I'm a big fan of doing the lures because I never really catch anything with these, but we'll give it a shot and if we don't catch anything, we'll switch over to the worms. But first I got to take this thing apart, like so just the bobber and stuff. So, and yeah, already. Alrighty, we'll see you then. Okay, this is what it looks like. You know, it's kind of funny when I felt it. It kind of looks like a... I thought it was like silver or... Not silver, what did you call it? Like kind of like... Uh, Metal-like feeling. But this is rubber. So, hmm, we'll have to see. Alrighty. Let's see. First cast and see how it goes. <clears throat> Let's see what's wrong with this rod first. All right, yep. Yeah, they're untied. Okay. <clears throat> Let's see if we can see if we can catch a fish with a lure. Hopefully, we will. Now I've never did this before with the lure. But, you know. Although, I don't know if this is a good idea because I'm... Mm -hmm. Am I stuck on something? I don't know. Based on the way it is. Oh, this detected if I wash my hands. I'm not washing my hands. It's not jumping out of the water. Oh, though, I don't know if this is a good idea. I mean, we're stuck in the weeds and stuff, and <laughs> of course. Not a good cast, I can tell you that right now. I might have to change it or something, I don't know. This is in the good pond. Alright, give me one second. Alright, this is not going to the rug, unfortunately, because it's due to there's so many weeds here, and not only that, I think it's a little bit too low to use this area. So... I do have another, I am planning on doing another lure, so, so let's see, I think I'm going to use this one, <clears throat> I haven't used this one in a while, because look at all of that, look at all the lily pads here, so I think that this might be a good idea to use this, 
and we'll probably switch over to warms but I'm probably gonna make it a little bit um, short because due to that so let's see what happens we'll have to try this again another day another pond maybe I'll go to the other pond and try it out with this I don't know but it's worth a shot you know I thought this was a good on the good place to use it because due to the you know <clears throat> because you know I've caught a bass here before not with lures but all right so we're gonna try using this thing and you know see what we'll do all righty all right we're gonna try this little frog here and we're gonna go with the flow and hopefully we'll catch something this will be a great way trick to catch bass some fishes here because look at all the lily ponds here this is probably a perfect idea to use it on lily ponds so let's see Although I could have cast a little bit further than that. Let me see if I can cast a little further than that. I mean, that was kind of weak. I know. I don't know. We'll just give it a shot and see. I might have not had the drag. I don't know if it's because of the drag or something like that. Because, I mean, I had to get that thing loose because due to... Because I had to get that out. Because I was stuck in the plants and stuff, so... Let's see. the cast well, let's see I don't know if even basses can go that far so I mean let's give it a shot although I kind of wish I want to get under the pads what do you think oh Oh, I did something that's not good. Huh. Oh, that's what happened. The top of the line got tangled. What the heck happened here? Alright. Yo. I don't want to go over here like where the pads are. Alright, well I think that's good enough. I one time did use this and I actually almost, what do I want to say almost, I thought it was going to catch a fish. But unfortunately it might have just got out. So, let's see. My time that I wasted. All right, so, I don't know, I'm just going to give it a shot. I got to see my frog is. I'm not sure if they're up for this frog, but. We may have to go for drastic measures. So, let's see. Yeah. 
chilled. Where the heck did it go? Oh shoot, that was my frog. Oh dang it, I just lost. I just lost the frog. Oh dang. <laughs> oh well. Now we do have to go with warmth. I flinged it, the next thing you know, I just lost it. Oh gosh. Ah. Story of my life. Just not having any luck today. Well, at this pond. This pond has a history of getting messy and all that stuff, like such as like getting really messy here. Oh, come on. <clears throat> I don't know where my frog is. It's probably somewhere. So, well, well, I guess I'll just maybe have to get a new one. You know. Oh gosh, look at this. <laughs> all right, I just gotta see what I'm doing here. I'll be back. Well, after so many failed attempts on the lures and all that stuff, I'm just going to go with the, the frog. I mean, no. Just going to go with the thing. Also, too, I have the, the not recommended weights that I'm using, but I just don't really feel like I don't have time to do all that stuff right now. I'm just going to... Um, yeah, I'm just gonna just go with this one. Oh, come on. What kind of a cast was that, buddy? Well, at least I got the worm. And the heart. All right, well, whatever. No. Yeah, them, of course. Oh, yeah, it's doing some action. I just thought it started, just started doing some action. Although, I hope that was me. I hope that was a fish. Trust me, I've wasted so many fish from the last video. It wasn't funny. Let me see if I can cast a little further, but let's see how the worm is. Well, it looks like it's still good, it's still there, but Oh yeah, it's doing some action right there. I don't know if they're just nibbling around it. You know, sometimes they just nibble right around it. Yeah, so if we're gonna use the worms, we're gonna have to do it this way. <laughs> because all the other things weren't too well, like successful like such as like um the other things was just too unsuccessful like such as the <clears throat> oh. it seemed like they just started it i mean i don't know now it doesn't look like they got nothing out of it if that's the case. Well, it looks like I still have it, but... Well, I think they're nibbling around there, but... Oh! Alright, well, let me see. Can't be that too hard just to gulp the darn thing.
I wish for some reason I can cast a lot farther than that. That's how I caught the bass. My first bass there. I don't know. I don't know if it depends on the line you have or it depends on the, I don't know, things you have. I have no idea. So, if I can catch a fish. They're probably going to be bluegills. You'd be darn lucky to catch a... You would probably be darn lucky if you caught... I'd be darn lucky if I caught a bass. doing it. It just sunk it in. It's... It just sunk it in. It wants to get it. It wants to get it. It does. It looks like it wants to get it. But it sounds like it's just doing the games on me. Like it's been doing. All right, hold on a second. I, I kind of left it a little bit too long because due to its um, filming and all this stuff, I mean, not only that, I have the cam cam camera at a certain angle. I can't really see it that well. Oh no. <sighs> Got caught in the lily pad. Let's see. Um, that's not a fish. It does not count. <clears throat> Great. That does not count as a fish. That does not count as a fish. This just counts as a pad. It's not a fish at all. So. <clears throat> Alright, let's see what we have to do here. Let me see if I can adjust the warm a little bit and see if, see if we'll be hitting. Looks like it's good enough, but uh, not good enough to catch something. You gotta like keep the hook hidden. So all right, let's see. Alright, um Yeah. I don't know if I should have put a new hook anyway. I mean no hook. New worn. But we're just gonna give it a shot. Look at that, I'm not even focusing and I don't know where the, my bobber is. Oh, great. Just what I needed. It's stuck. It's so hard with all these lily pads and all this stuff in the way. And you can't see nothing out of it. It's like... If you can avoid the lily pads, if you can, they'll be great. But you can't because it depends on where it goes. Hmm. I don't know. Just having no luck. Oh, looks like the weight went down a little bit on it. So let's see how this is going to go.
Ow, that hit my face. They're small? They're everything's small. <laughs> I see. <laughs> well, I'll see what I can do. You got it? Okay. What the? Alright, give me a second. All right, I'm going to go over here because there's a lot of um, space here. And I just lost another hook too because, well, I don't know. It got caught in the weeds or something like that. <clears throat> I must have not tied it up good enough and, and all this stuff. So, yeah. <clears throat> all right. There's, I don't know if you saw, there's a group, a family group here told me that the fish are small. So, maybe like small as bluegills or something like that. Well, we we'll just have to take a look. All right, let me reset this whole thing again, and hopefully we'll catch a fish before I start leaving soon. Because I gotta go to a bowling, you know, I gotta go to a bowling league tonight. So, all right. All right. Well, guess what? During the editing, I had to put a new worm in there. Well, not just a new worm, but a new hook. I actually triple knot this this time. Yeah, that's right. I triple knotted. I also had to put a new battery in, which is kind of odd because it was only like a few percentage left, like like maybe like 40% the last time I checked, but I don't know. <clears throat> so we're just going to give this a shot before, I don't know. Yeah, like I said, I triple knot this, like, you know, like, I'm going to see if that will work. And yeah. All right. I don't know. I'm just not having any lucky today. Not any luck today. Of course, doesn't like to cast that far. I probably don't have the recommended weight, but whatever. It's just the way it is right now. I got things to do. That's the only thing. I just want to catch a fish. I mean, I mean, any fish matters, but and I'm getting really tired of it because I'm getting I'm losing so many things. Lots of hooks. I mean, I don't know how many hooks I've lost today. Probably lost so many of them. It's not a joke. So yeah, well, it doesn't look like it's going to do any action now because it probably just ate the entire worm or whatever it did. So uh, I don't know. Let's see. It probably is need a new worm. What the? No. Yep, it needs a new worm. Just like it does. Ah, you're kidding me. Well, I mean, like I said, I don't have the recommended... I, I put... I didn't put the recommended... Uh, weights on there, sorry. I couldn't think for a second. So, I don't know, it's just the way it is right now. I'm just going to figure out what's going on, and I'll see you guys then. All right, I'll be right back. Get away from my ears, because don't get in my ears. What if you do? That was that happened off camera. I don't know if these were dragon... But don't go in my ears. Sorry. All righty, let's see. Yeah. Yeah. The only reason I put the hooks, I mean, not hooks, weights and all this stuff, because I didn't really have time. I was switching off with the lures and all this stuff, so you guys already know, but that was unsuccessful, so. Well. So. Maybe I would have cast a little further if I had put the recommended weight on, but I didn't, so. Oh well, it is what it is. So. Did 
Did I catch something or something weird? Come on. I'm not even washing my hands. What's going on with my thing? I'm... Stop going in my ears, will ya? Oh, I caught a fish. Good. Oh, geez. It's kind of a weird uh, way to do it, so kind of like <clears throat> odd way, but whatever. Anyway, this is, looks like a, a bluegill. Doesn't even look like. Is it even alive? Because. I don't know. All right, let me see. All right, yep, it's still alive. It looks like it's alive, so let's see. All right. Okay, that was kind of like an odd way to catch a fish like that, but at least I caught something out of it. Jeez, man, I mean, <clears throat> not too bad. I just had to find the trickiest way to get like in there and yeah like how the way to catch a fish that way it's like I have to outsmart the thing I guess now I see what's wrong with it must have um oh yeah yeah it looked I mean I had a definite that I caught that fish but this wasn't like the way it was acting like it it was just I don't know Nope. Okay, don't pull games on me right now. Oh. Alright. At least I caught a fish. That makes me happy after all of the unsuccessful things that was going on with me. You know, with the hooks losing, the lures losing. Yeah, did I catch a fish? Nope, I didn't. All right. Um, all right, well, no big deal. Right, at least I thought I had an idea, but it's not. I think what I might try to do is that I might try to, when I get home, I mean, I don't know when I'm going to do it, but I'm going to think, uh, um... I think what I'm going to do is that unhook this, probably triple knot this. I mean, this is actually working pretty good. Maybe that's what I should do, triple knot it. That way I'm not losing all the hooks and all the stuff. So I'm going to see if I can put one more weight on it and see if that will do the trick. You know, maybe cast a little further, but I don't know. Can't always know what's going on. All right, then. See you guys later. All righty. Now, I did put another weight on there. The... The, uh, no good weights and all this stuff because you know that's not the weight I usually use so but we'll just have to do this right now until we get home see if I cast well it didn't do any good I mean like cast any further than that Maybe I would have caught something like a bass or something like that, but I'm happy to catch that fish though. E you know, small though, but worth it though. So, all right, let's just see though. I was kind of like a that's kind of good way to do it. It's past four o'clock right now. I'll just fish for a few more minutes and then we'll just be on our way. I like to catch a little bit further away so that way I can maybe catch something over there. I mean, maybe, I mean, there could be some, obviously some bluegills over there, but, but nothing particular. But you know, then I'll just go back to the other pond. 
But as of right now, we're just gonna fish at this spot. Yeah, it's doing some action. It's probably another bluegill or some kind of small fish. I got it. Nope, I didn't. The ball sunk a little bit, and usually that indicates that I catch a fish, but huh, I don't know, guys. Something tied up in the on the top of it did it. Yep, it did. Swing this around. Okay. Now give me your big toss. Hmm. Ah. <laughs> no good. Although I better get ready because it's starting to do some action. That I don't think they cast that far either. I don't know. I'm not gonna. I'm like not going to cast any farther if the way this is rigged up. Is that me or is it my bob? Ah, jeez. Bet there's some good fishes out there on that side over there. Hmm, but I don't know. Yeah, it's doing it. But it's like it's a standstill. I don't know if basses can go that far, come here. Usually this is, usually they're way out there. All right, I don't know. I mean, I'm probably just gonna wrap this up. It's getting a little late and I gotta get ready for tonight. So, let's see. All right, that's going to be the wrap for the day and all this stuff. So at least I catched, well, actually I caught one fish and all this stuff. So, you know, I mean, I guess that when I set up this rod, I guess I kind of messed it up and all this stuff. I used to cast a little further with that, but I don't know. I'm just going to see what's up and all that stuff. So maybe I'll put the right recommended uh, weight and all this stuff. And as for uh, lures, well... I guess I'll just have to try again another day. I mean, that was just pretty unlucky because it got all weeds and all the stuff. So there was this guy I talked to. He was on the he was on the side I was on, and he said that like, you know you go beyond the the dock area and like there's a little narrow road and all the stuff and all that stuff there. So uh, yeah, and oh, you, you catch some good fishes right there. So if that's the case, though might try that I don't know when but you know who knows so yeah like I said I'll get this thing fixed up I'll probably do it before I go fishing next time and like you said like I said earlier 
I'm going to Aruba. I will be doing some videos there, so I just thought I'd let you guys know. I mean, yeah, I'm gonna actually do, I'm gonna post all my Aruba videos on my channel. So if you wanna look forward to that, you might wanna subscribe and hit that notification bell button because that's what I'll do. So yeah, it's just like kind of like a vlog and all that stuff. I mean, I'll try to do some filming there, you know, at the beach or whatever, whatever I have to do there. So, it's pretty unique though. So, yeah. Alrighty guys, that's about it. I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.